How's it going everyone? My name is Tyler and in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to install a loading screen for your 5M server. So first of all what we're going to go ahead and do is we want to go ahead and open up the first link in the description I'll leave you. It's going to be to a 5M loading screen. First what you're going to do is you want to go ahead and hit clone or download. And then go ahead and hit download to zip. You're going to need Rumor for this um, to, op to, to open it up in Rinrar. Go to if you, I cannot talk today guys, I'm so sorry. Go ahead and drag and drop it to your desktop. Go ahead and um, find a logo that you want for it. So if you have a logo, um, drag and drop it to your desktop and then name it logo.png. This will essentially make your logo for your server. Now go ahead and open up your res or your loading screen, that zip. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and open up the loading screen master folder that you have downloaded from your zip folder. Now, I, I do not have JavaScript, so j.js means JavaScript. Go ahead and um, right click on it and hit rename. Go ahead and, oh, I can't do that. And then go ahead and make sure it's config.cfg. Now once it's config.cfg, you can go ahead and open it up, or not that. Now once you have opened your config.cfg in there, um, you can actually go ahead and find a YouTube video that you, or a YouTube song that you like. Go ahead and mine right now as everything black. Now what you what you are going to want to do is you want to go ahead and find the URL to the video, which is up here. Now you will see an equal sign. From the equal sign on, this is a called a YouTube ID. Go ahead and hit Control C on that. Then go ahead and minimize. Now make sure you'll see you see music true. Now, if music is true, that means music will play. So we'll go ahead and see these inside quotes. You'll see video ID. Go ahead and highlight the inside of the quotes. And then go ahead and hit backspace and hit control V. Hit control S. I suggest you to leave the music volume where you at, where it, where it is at, because if you change it at all, it'll mess everything up. So just leave it at what it is. Now, so, so now we have a title at the bottom. What you want to do is, what you're going to want to do is, you want to go ahead and highlight the inside and hit backspace. And our roleplay server is called um, Deadline RP. I'm gonna name it Test Server. Make sure you hit Control S on there. Now, in the title, there's a um, Discord link. You can either place it with a motto or your Discord um, link. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a motto so. Live life, life to, um, we'll do, we'll do live life to role play. So now we have live life to role play, deadline RP. So that's what's going to show at the bottom of your screen. So everyone knows it's our motto. Now, what you guys want to do is you want to go ahead and make sure you hit control S one more time to save everything. And let's look through one more time, make sure we have everything. So we have our config uh, folder, folder done. So you can go ahead and hit, um, click X on that, make sure you hit yes if that shows. You see config.cfg, um, right click, hit rename, and then go ahead and hit con config.js to put it back to where it was for JavaScript. So now everything's set in your um, config folder. Now you will see an image folder. You will see a original logo.png, which is this right here. This is the original one. Go ahead and right click on it and hit delete or remove or delete files. Yes. Now once logo PNG is gone, you can go ahead and smack that in there. You'll see a new logo.png which you have dragged onto your desktop. Then go ahead and hit OK. You'll see a logo.png which you can open up and there's our deadline RP logo. Now we're going to drag the um, logo.png to the left side, just you know, to keep everything organized. Go into backspace. Everything is all set now. You can go ahead and look through your images. That's what it looks like right there. Then once it gets to this one, you'll see an um, my RP server. Um, this is the title that you put in. So this is the that's the title and that's the description or the. Thing that we put in for our, our motto. So our motto is going to show up right there and this is what our title is going to show up. But sometimes if it takes long it doesn't really load up that well. So you now this is your index.html. So this is what it looks like right now. You can check it. So then this is what it will look like when you uh, load into the game. So you'll see deadline RP. 
and it'll say live life to role play and then it has our death on repeat this is what it looks like um i'm pretty sure i hope the music works but um yeah so now i'm gonna go ahead and minimize that go ahead and hit the backspace and you'll see this loading screen master now go ahead and open up do not worry about this right now go ahead and open up your actually now you can do this or open up your resources folder um, so if you open up your server folder, so this is what you're what you load in, and go ahead and hit CFX Server Data Master, then go ahead and double click on resources. Go ahead and drag and drop the um, Z loading screen master into your resources folder. Right click, hit rename, hit control C. I'm gonna hit control C one more time. And then now you'll see that. So now your loading screen's placed. Go ahead and go back to your CFX server data master and then double click on resources.cfg. Now once you're in resources.cfg, Go ahead, and you won't see that. Go ahead and hit enter, then type start, hit control V, and then hit control S one more time. So then now you are you have it installed. That's it, guys. Go ahead and um, X out of that. I'm going to go ahead and open up our server folder one more time just to boot the server up to show you guys what it is. Go ahead and double click on start.bat. Then it will load up. Come on. It takes, it takes a couple seconds to load up because I have a lot of resources. There you go. Started resources, or started resource, Z loading screen, master. Go ahead and um, minimize that. I'm going to go ahead and open up our 5M. <sighs> Sorry if the screen cuts out for a few seconds. So now, once you are here, <coughs> sorry about that. Uh, so I find I'm gonna work or what? Apparently, my phantom doesn't want to work. Okay, that's fine. Let's reload it back up. Sorry about that, guys. My 5M doesn't want to work apparently. And make sure. Oh, and a, a lot of people, a lot of you, been asking um, what's going on with the starter.bat folder, and it actually has something to do um, with an issue that's been going on in the 5M community. Um, but I will make a separate video on that here in a, in a few minutes. So go ahead and once you're at your main 5M, you know, server. Sorry about that. Go ahead and hit localhost. Then you'll load in, and then there you go. So there's your deadline RP, and then there's your music. And then you'll see it. There you go. There's our there's our server. So we have everything in there. So that's how it was installed, guys. So if you did enjoy the video, please drop a like and subscribe to my channel for more of those videos. So guys, thank you very much for watching. And I appreciate all the support. And I will see you guys later. Peace.